हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू नंद किशोर क्लासेस टुडे लेक्चर इज गोइंग टू बी वेरी इंटरेस्टिंग बिकॉज टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न अ शॉर्टकट ट्रिक टू फाइंड क्यूब ऑफ एनी डबलेट यस बट फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल यू शुड नो वॉट इज अ डबलेट डबलेट मीन्स लाइक अ डिजिट नंबर ट्वेंटी टू थर्टी थ्री फोर्टी फोर फिफ्टी फाइव सिक्सटी सिक्स दीज आर नोन एज डबलेट्स when both digits are same now finding cube of them using a shortcut is going to be very interesting and time saving as well i am going to start with a 22 cube 22 cube try to learn it carefully what is 22 cube see my main digit is 2 here right it is getting repeated make a four spaces i have made four spaces first of all then do the cube of 2 only cube of 2 is 8 what you need to do write 8 at all the spaces this is the first step writing 8 at all the four places and then leave this space leave this space we will just focus on the middle two numbers just do double of them double means multiplying by 2 like when 8 is multiplied by 2 you will get 16 when this 8 is multiplied by 2 you will get 16 and we just need to add now but addition is very important how to add have a look this 8 will remain as it is now 16 plus 8 16 plus 8 is 24 so you need to write 4 here and 2 will be carried to the next value 16 plus 8 24 24 plus 2 26 i'm writing 6 here and 2 is carried to the next value finally 8 plus 2 is 10 so that means 22 cube is 10648 now you should remember those who are not aware 22 cube means in fact i should have told earlier it is like you are multiplying 22 3 times which which is not easy to do but using this shortcut quick answer can be found i hope this method is clear we are going to do one more example so that concept is clear properly after 22 cube let us suppose you want to do 33 cube rule is already explained i am not going to change the rule now as told earlier make four spaces 3 cube is 27 right okay write 27 at every space 27 27 and 27 second step was placing cross because i want to leave those spaces blank below the middle two values we were writing double of that double means multiplying by 2 so double of 27 is 54 double of 27 is 54 and what we need to do now we just need to add them but do remember this 27 i will not write blindly 27 here no i will write only 7 this two i am going to carry to the next value that means two i am going to write here now add them 7 plus 4 11 11 plus 2 13 okay three is coming here one is carried add them 5 plus 2 7 7 plus 1 8 but i will not write 8 here otherwise it will become a two digit number 8 will be carried to the next value try adding them again 8 plus 7 15 15 plus 4 19 so write 9 here one will be carried 5 plus 2 7 7 plus 1 8 but we will not write 8 here single digit is already there 8 will be moved to next value now 27 plus 8 is 35 
so 35937 is the answer for 33q i hope you are clear with this concept okay one more example we will do because i know many questions would be going on in your mind how next number would be done let us do one more question that question is 55q because 5 cube is a three digit number and you must be thinking that for three digit number how the calculations will be done let us do it 55 cube 5 cube is 125 so i am writing 125 four times right four times it is written obviously twice i am making crosses because i wanted to keep boundary values blank a double of 125 is 250. So let me write here 250. Just add them. How to add? From 125, I will write only 5. 12 will be shifted to next value. Now we need to add them again. 5 plus 2, 7. Now adding the initial values, 25 plus 12, 37, 37 plus 1, 38. I am not going to write here. This front value 38 will be shifted to the next term. Now see 8 plus 5, 13. I will write 3 here and 1 is further carried. Now let me add all of them. 25 plus 12, 37, 37 plus 3. 40, 40 plus 1, 41. But don't write 41 here. 41 is carried to the next value. Adding these two, 5 plus 1, 6. 4 plus 2, 6. Then 1. 1, double 6, 3, 7, 5. This is the cube of 55. These tricks can be used in different competitive exams and especially in the classroom teaching also. Many students find maths boring subject, even though it is not, but still, you know, it's not everybody's cup of tea at that time. Then to create their interest in the subject, these type of different tricks we usually use in the class so that they can find some alternate ways of doing the solutions, having fun at that same time, right? So this is very important. It's going to be helpful. Thank you so much for watching the video.